Hey guys, how's it going? This is Dilmer again and welcome back to my channel. So I wanted to talk about this topic because this was a topic that I almost make me cry when, when I found out that somebody cloned my game. It was when I released Cubix, I think a couple of months after the release, I got a lot of people in social media sending me messages telling me, Dilmer, your game was cloned and, and it was funny because they sent me the pictures of that person, the that person cloned. And, and it was literally exactly the same game. My game was simple, don't get me wrong, but the even the levels were laid, were, were laid out exactly the same. The, the music was exactly the same. Everything about the game was exactly the same. So you might ask right now and, and tell me, Dilmer, did you panic? And I'm gonna say, yes, I panic. Were you super scared? Yes, I was super scared. Did you freak out? I did freak out. And I was really, really sad. I got really, really depressed. I'm, I'm smiling right now, and the reason why I'm smiling right now is because I went, you know, that happened so many times for every one of the games that I release. And it served me as a lesson. It served me as a lesson to know that it doesn't matter how how much protection we get, it doesn't matter how much we, you know, we ask the marketplace, the platforms to, to do, there's always gonna be somebody that it's gonna clone your game, and you gotta deal with it. You gotta just get over it. And so what happened when I released in Steam is as soon as I released the game in Steam and, and actually it wasn't released until like a few, few weeks after, but as soon as I put the game and it was available, people saw the game that I was going to post and how much exposure the game was getting, I started to get a couple of clones and the games were just exactly the same. So I was able to get a few of those games out and the way that I did that is I contacted I contacted Steam, I, I talked to the customer the customer support, I sent them a screenshot and they asked me for a lot of information about my studio, when did I originally release the game and they removed some of those games out. But there was one that I couldn't get removed and, and what happened with that one is they actually did a counter a counter complaint and the reason why his didn't get removed is because he did a counter complaint. So what, what did I need to, to, to fight that? I needed to get a lawyer. So what I, what I learned about that process is that I, you know, I have a small company and if I'm gonna have to hire a lawyer for every one of the games that I do, it's gonna, it's gonna cost me a lot of money and it's gonna cost me a lot of my time. So nowadays what I do is I, I just, you know, I know that people are gonna do it. I try to do and to make anything as unique as I can and as polished as I can and you know talk about my games i'm always in social media i'm always letting people know what i'm working on not only i do it just to get exposure but i, I also do it so people know what i'm working on and if, and if something else comes out somebody else tries to you know clone one of the things that i'm doing then then somehow people are going to link you back to link back the original creator so i hope this was helpful guys i know this was short but i i really needed to get this out and let Everybody know everybody that it's actually has the same concerns that I'm that I went through, and lastly, I want to tell you like as soon as you get a game clone, you know you're gonna get you're gonna be sad you're gonna be down, but now when it happens, it's actually something good. I'm actually you know I get flattered because people are cloning my creations, people are cloning what I create. So in some ways, it's a good thing. I know it, it is bad because they're gonna be, you know, they're cloning your, 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 your baby in a way, but at the same time, it's a good thing. It's a good thing, so, you know, once you get something cloned, that must be something good that you're doing. So don't get sad about it, don't get depressed. It's actually a good thing that people are cloning your games. So thank you again, guys. I hope this was helpful. If you have any questions, let me know through the comments. Thank you, guys.